All right, we're going to go ahead and get started. Good morning, everybody, and thank you guys for taking the time to join our Goodland Review New Product, Goodland Supply New Product Review webinar. This is the first installment of our series that we're going to continue monthly. Um, I would like to take the time to introduce George Kepler, who is the owner of Goodland Supply, so that he can give you a preview of what we'll be expecting today, as well as an overview of Goodland Supply. Hi, Take everybody. it away, George. Thanks. Hi, everybody. Uh, again, George Kepler, uh, co-owner at uh, Bruce City Brand and our wholesale division, uh, Goodland Supply. Um, I'll give you a quick overview of who we are and where we come from, and then we'll get into the meat and potatoes. Um, uh, we own and operate kiosks throughout the Milwaukee area um, that sell Milwaukee branded merchandise. Um, and we've done that for the last 34 years, where we design and create all of the own, our own products that we put through the kiosks. Um, and uh, I don't know if I mentioned, we're located at Mitchell International Airport, Milwaukee, Milwaukee Public Market, and other outdoor festivals. Um, the neat thing about coming up through the retail side of business is that we learned early on that for us, products had to sell. Um, and if they didn't sell, we couldn't pay our bills. Um, so our thought process has always been looking for products that are unique and different. Um, or that had some special attribute. And um, here internally, we call that energy. And we're always on the lookout for products with energy. Um, I head up the wholesale division of our company, Goodland Supply. And what we've learned through retail is also transferred over to our thought process on the, on the wholesale side. Um, we're constantly looking for that same energy or unique products. Um, today, we're gonna be looking at drinkware uh, with one of our top uh, suppliers in this area. And um, the energy or the trends that we see in this area is uh, based on quality for the most part. We're seeing that people are willing to spend a little bit more money, um, but they want that quality piece, something that's gonna last and be durable. And then they're also looking for some of the unique attributes of different color palettes or different matte finishes and, or, and things like that with their drinkware and their branding. Um, so uh, with that, I'm excited to get started here today and- Take it away, Jennifer. <laughs> Thank you so much, Kim. So again, I am Jennifer Foster. I am lucky enough to partner with an amazing drinkware company called ETS Express. So I'm gonna blow up my screen here just so that I can show you some of those wonderful products. And just wanted to make sure that you knew we focus on current trends, uh, targeted demographics. We want to make sure that we're giving you drinkware options by partnering with um, Goodland Supply and Versity Promotions. And you're going to see a lot of these in the visual form where you have more color palettes like George mentioned. But it's I'm also going to tackle the decoration and the way that you can really take your branding message, take these products and make them their, their, your own to tell your message to tell your story is probably the best way to phrase that. So giving you some inspiration behind some of this, I just wanted to take a second to show you some of the beautiful colors, the different palettes, a lot of the textures that you can see when you're looking at drinkware. So to just make sure that I'm kind of representing some of these current trends that I'm talking about and kind of mentioning to you along the way, I wanted you to just see an overall scheme and kind of run through some of the newer ideas. It's so fun right now to be able to offer new products and kind of get you excited about pieces that um, I think are going to really follow again current trends or give you some completely new ideas when you're trying to look at drinkware. So with something like this, I just think this is a great representation of what, again, what George mentioned when we're talking about color palettes. How can we take colors like the mink kind of gives you something more in the taupe, um, taupe family, still give you those neutrals that you're looking for, but help you to maybe look at assorting colors in addition to taking on the color that maybe you would already purchase for your drinkware or other promotional product needs. Something like this one is meant to really go along with that kind of thinner, taller bottle or travel mug that's very popular right now. We've also tried to give you new ideas, like I mentioned, where we can come up. We're designing our pieces internally. So that's so important. We're looking at all the little nuances to give you new ideas with your drinkware needs. So something like the opal here, this will be a new piece. Just in case this is one that catches your attention, um, I wanted to, be, we'll have stock in something like this one next month. So it's a little bit of a preview with this piece but I wanted to make sure that you saw that we can kind of reinvent a little bit of what you would think of for your ceramic mug. 
In this instance, we've added a silicone sleeve on it. That's why you'll notice here on the left hand side, again, getting these these colors in front of you. Wanted to make sure that you saw you can take this ceramic cup and have the lip kind of sticking out at the top here to give that ceramic kind of glossiness to it. And then by adding that silicone sleeve in this instance, you get kind of a frosted look below it. You can take off that silicone sleeve if you're wanting to um, clean it. And then it's also going to be packaged, as you can see over here, in its own tray and in its own box. We focus a lot on making sure that you have individual gift boxes partnered with the products. So if it's something you're passing out to your employees or you're passing out to your customers, for example, we want to make sure that you have something that's easy to open and distribute very accordingly. One of the bigger trends that we've been seeing, um, I would say probably for a few years now, but the glass bottles have really taken on this, this whole new fresh look to them. In this case, just promoting it with kind of eco looks. How can we give you something that has that, that same feel with the glass that you know, but still give you something a little bit different? So you'll notice this, that we have a bamboo lid on something like this one. The great part with something like the lid size on this, you're going to be able to imprint the lid as well. So you have the entire glass to work with. We, we create full designs, which I'll, um, I'm sorry, 360 degree designs so if you want them all around the bottle, which I'll get into in a little bit. But it's all about taking these colors, as George mentioned once again, and giving you something that's unique and different. Patterns are always something that are being requested. We wanted to focus on when I mentioned a lot of current trends. We're trying to make sure that we have things that go along with the workplace kitchen as well as the home kitchen. Adding marble to your backsplash, adding marble to your countertops is such, it's everywhere. We all, we all are seeing that, especially now while we're home more. So the idea of being able to incorporate a bottom imprint on something like this and still have that pattern on there. You can see we did this in two different sizes, taking mugs that sell really well in the 14 ounce size, giving you something that's more of a traditional C handle, but with this modern touch to it and allowing you to add your decoration. We're also showing off in this page just some of the, again these inspirations, giving you some of these new colors that you'll see within this section of products as well. But one of the main things we're trying to do and giving you kind of more of that retail look when you're adding your branding to it, in addition to things that will kind of be driven more towards maybe like uh, more of a tea drinker. So we want to make sure again we're covering everything so that you have options no matter what kind of drinkware that you're looking to purchase. So something like this one is just showing you how we've created a mesh container. The illusion with this one though is gonna, this is actually something that's a little bit smaller in size. This is 10 ounces. We wanted to give you something more of a ceramic mug, but provide that insulation that is so important and that we're seeing more requests for that you're finding when you're out and about at the store or ordering something online. It's about maintaining that temperature. And so this is just giving you an example of something that's smaller in stature, but still offers you that same insulation on a piece that um, allows you to put your loose tea leaves in here with that strainer. I want to make sure that I kind of show this one off a little bit later as well, because it is something that has some a great decoration on it. But this is one that has a cup with the piece itself. So it's kind of two pieces in one, if you will. You have your water bottle on here. And then in addition, you have something with the cup. So when you have it and you place it on top, you have this amazing magnetic <laughs> cup. So when you do place this turned upside down or run around with it, you have a really sturdy cup that's going to stay on top of the piece. This is one of my favorites um, at the very beginning. If some of you had uh, kind of logged on, George and I were talking about some of the new favorite ones. And this is one of these water bottles that I've kind of fallen in love with personally because it's one that, as you kind of saw on that slide, it has this decoration on the base of it. It has a pattern, not really decoration, I guess, all the way around the base of the piece because we wanted to make sure that we gave you something that had plenty of imprint area, but also has a pattern or a design to partner with it. It has that carrying handle, so this goes very much in line with how can we make sure that you have something that is designed well. The carrying handle on this has a little bit of a rubber stopper to it. Something, something as simple as that just allows you to make sure that you don't scratch your bottle. These are the things that we're constantly looking at to ensure that your bottle is made well and that you have something that you know you can pass out with confidence. 
The biggest trends on the ceramic side of things is the clay pieces. Uh, I, I see a commercial, I feel like every day when I'm not fast forwarding through it on my DVR, that um, is going to be showing off someone's drinking out of a clay piece. I've seen it for different companies um, in social media feeds, in your everyday life when you're walking into a store or ordering something. In terms of ceramics, the clay is everywhere in our kind of interior design world or restructuring or doing anything uniquely to our home. But we wanted to make sure that we had more options. We introduced quite a few last year, and so we wanted to bring a new one in for 2021. The way that I talk about this one is that it has speckles on there. If you like that kind of campfire look, you have the clay base to keep it nice and modern. And then you have a handle on here that is not, it has a good size to it. So it's going to work well for men. It's going to work well for women. And then it's 17 ounces. So on average, we're drinking something like three cups of coffee a day. This one hopefully will give you a cup and a half in one place so that you can get your day started off right. Going into these uh, next two sections of pieces here, I wanted to make sure that you saw we've added some kind of fun, really bright colors while still giving you a lot of those neutrals. I mean, if they if this color isn't everywhere that I'm seeing right now, it's that really kind of fun lime, almost green that you see everywhere that has that yellow tinge to it. So even though we're partnering with a lot of the neutral colors that you may need for your everyday life. Again, it's looking at things like assorting colors and getting creative with the way that you're having them distributed because we are going to make sure that we're keeping up again, like I mentioned a few times, the current trends and something like this one, I think shows off some of these colors that are really hot right now. This one is just going to give you something that's easy to use and on the go. So if you're somebody when you're typing all day, and you want to have something where you can quickly use it with one hand, you're in the car, you want something again that's easy to grab, you're on a walk with your friends. It's something where you can push, you have a push button in the front here, your spout cover will go back, you can drink out of it, and then it's also like just kind of ergonomically friendly, if that's the right way to phrase it with this one, where you have that indent so it's really easy to hold and drink out of this one while you're doing something else. Bringing in a new look entirely, but kind of grabbing something from that old school feel. This is just showing off our retro bottle. We wanted to get you excited again about something that can be placed on a shelf for others to see, something for you to give, give away, something for you to kind of, again, have something more nostalgic in a look. Take your logo and let's place, let's get creative with it. Let's make it look like a label. That's the whole idea with something like this, taking that, that logo that means so much to you, again, telling your story and having some fun with it in a unique way. So this is a way again to kind of create that old school bottle look and partner it with your logo in a unique fashion. If you are someone who likes a strawed water bottle, I don't know if strawed is a word, but a straw water bottle, um, it's something that's important to you. This is one that's gonna give you technology that's done really well with us in the past. We wanted to provide you with a stainless steel option because we've carried this lid before, but it's been partnered with a plastic bottle. So what this does is this button behind the carrying handle here is this, I should say the straw will be flat. You push this button here and the straw will pop up. This is something that's pretty expensive out in the retail world. So you're gonna be able to come in at a really friendly price point when you're trying to narrow down your choices of water bottles. And you'll have that lid with the straw if it's something that um, you prefer when you're, when you're distributing your pieces. The last set of pieces here that I just wanted to make sure I mentioned, we brought in kind of the newest versions and the more modern versions of pieces that are popular. We partner with a brand named Contigo. So we have quite a few of their items in our line and the, the Byron is one of our better sellers. So I just wanted you to see the version. Um, most of the time you'll probably see it like a Target, Bed Bath & Beyond, but they have such a wide array of places that you can purchase this online or otherwise. So just wanted you to see that the Byron is one that sells as well and that we're carrying it in two different sizes so this is the newest version of that option finally just wanted to go through a few ceramic pieces and kind of end with this stainless steel one here before i get into the decoration side of things with you um, with this one it's going to give you something it's a nice stainless steel water bottle when you are trying to find something effective in um, a, a nice price point so what we wanted to do was give you a new powder coated piece we know that's all the trend 
what do you have that can kind of withstand more wear and tear? You see all these different materials on the outside of water bottles. When you grab them off the shelf most of the time now, or again, order one and kind of get a feel of it before you decide you like to keep it from online. This is one that has that kind of really nice texture to it that you know when you put it down and pick it up, it's going to withstand quite a bit. So we just wanted to give you a new option with this by providing you with a matching gasket color. So that, that little um, silicone piece on top of the lid that helps keep the lid fastened and tightened onto the item, instead of just making it kind of a mirror thing off to the side, we wanted to take the color and match it with the powder coating in this case. The last couple pieces here will be just kind of modern takes, giving you something new for um, your ceramic mug needs. And I think what, what better way to show that off than give you something ombre or have that gradient kind of built into the mug itself. We have a water bottle with these exact same colors. So if this look catches your attention, it's something that you think will work really well for your needs. Um, you can talk to whoever your rep is within Goodland Supply and Brew City Promotions, and we can work to, um, again, give you some samples based on the sample requests that you mentioned. We're just showing off different color options, but again, if you like this look, we also have a water bottle to kind of match, if you will. And with these two, I'm going to toggle back and forth real briefly because I just wanted to make sure that you saw that we have a new stackable mug. How important is that to really make sure that your space is being utilized to the best effort possible? So we wanted to make sure that we had something that you could stack and place in your cabinets. Um, if you have a coffee station, maybe in the office space, it's going to help you to kind of have more room. So these are going to give you two different exterior color palettes to work with. And finally, in terms of new items where I think we've really been able to get adventurous and give you some new ideas is we've added a metallic finish to this. So again, much like I mentioned before, you have your traditional C handle look with this whole new take on it. And then you have something a little bit larger in size, just depending on how big you like to have your ceramic mugs, right? So that's gonna give you a little bit of an overview of some of the newer pieces just to get you excited. Sorry, it takes me one second here to go to the next screen. So I wanna make sure I was all ready for you. Um, just wanted to make sure that you kind of saw some of those pieces that are new and exciting. Now, how do I take this? How do you take this? How do we how do we partner with Goodland Supply and Brew City to make sure we can take these pieces and really show off something for you that is is unique to your message and to your story? And showing off something like this, and I'm going to go through just a few pages here, is really where we shine. You can see that we have unique products. Like I mentioned, we design them internally. We are taking uh, cues from things that are current and out there in the retail world, but we're trying to make sure that you can put your spin on them uniquely. And this is some really good descriptions and some really beautiful designs that we thought we could share. And with your ceramic mugs and quite a bit of your glassware, I wanted to start off just briefly mentioning the bottom imprint. You want to take your logo and wrap it around. You want to take your symbol. You want to take your website. You have a private joke that you have within the office. How funny is that when you go to grab your ceramic mug and that's what they see at the bottom of it? when you're in the conference room or having fun. So it's nice to be able to have this secondary place for you. So you have this kind of full amount of area on the ceramic mug. You can print on two sides, whatever works best for you. And then on the bottom, again, you have that secondary place. Taking it to that same level, but just showing you it in other locations, something like our camper mug, you can engrave the handle on it. We have two different sizes in this one, but you can engrave the handle as well as screen print the handle. So again, it, the reason I say that is it's just based on the artwork that you're wanting to showcase. But we do a lot and it works well for the base imprints as well. Hashtags are a big one right now. Take that, that something, maybe it's a an important uh, charity that you're working with. However you want to tell your story, whether it be the hashtag with something that you have trending on new products, we just want to make sure that you have a clever way to tie it together with the products. So you have that bottom imprint, the lid imprint is available on probably like about 45 different pieces. And then if it's something that's more of a camper mug, which is definitely one of the biggest, hottest, most trending products right now, you know that you can utilize that handle as well. Now we have very, I'm going to actually sneak behind just a second here. I wanted to make sure that I showed you something unique and that is our mirror print. This is a visual that I can expand upon further. If you like the kind of general message or this thing, it makes sense for something that you're wanting to display. This is one where I will give an example is more kind of like that special event and you want your product to stick out uniquely. 
our mirror print, what we do with this is it can be done on any product that's see, see through. So think glass, think plastic. You're taking the logo that you want to show as the forefront of the piece, and then you're taking the secondary one that you'd like to show, or maybe you're putting two logos together. Maybe you have a special anniversary logo. Your company is 50 years old and you want to have a 50th anniversary uh, logo in addition to your main one. Instead of canceling it out and printing one side and then on the second side, what we're saying is that you can print on the front and then by simply, and again, I know it's harder to see visually, but you can print on the inside of that same design. We can find a way to make it two-sided for you without it being two-sided essentially. So if that's something that catches your attention, then we again can work with you and the Goods Land Supply team to help um, create that visual and give you that effective look that you're trying to recreate. Digital, we know now, oh my goodness, everybody you wanna have, it makes so much sense. You're, you're showing off colors. You have gradients like you saw on that mug with the colors fading into the other colors, um, giving you several tones in one place. This is just showing you that we, it's something that we can print digitally when you have that artwork. Um, we can take that vector art and create something really beautiful for you. The other two types of decoration are ones that we've just really seen explode. And so I think when you are trying to find something unique, I recommend foil decoration as something to give you that really powerful impact with something that has a tremendous sheen on it. When I say sheen, what we've done is we've taken a wide array of colors, your golds, your platinums, your coppers, even things like blue and pink and red that you are used to seeing every day. How can you make them? change them and make them look different. Even rose gold, we know that that's a trend that hasn't gone anywhere and we wanna be able to offer you a unique way to again pack that powerful punch with something that's almost got a shine to it that will make it stick out more and people will see it from afar. So this is just a little bit of a visual of showing you some of those colors in one space. And then the bottle that I held up will show you some of those other colors. And then there's the engraving look. We still think this is something that's in, impactful. It's still so important. Um, I'm gonna hope that I can show these off somewhat vividly. This is gonna show you something that has that sheen on it in more of the foil version. And then you can see it based on what you might wanna see. And I know with camera, it's harder, just showing you off something that has the engraved feel next to it. So you know that you have two different ways to, again, decorate your pieces that um, can either be something more on the engraved side of things or laser side of things, or you have something that you can have that higher, that higher kind of like sheen look to it. The last thing that I kind of wanted to mention, because we know it's something that's coming up so much every day now, is that if you are wanting to take any of these products, we know that people are working from home, we know that people are working from um, the office, and having these, this is just one example of one that we have different options, but I just wanted to let you know if you're needing to drop ship them, we can offer that for you as well. Taking your idea, creating it into a piece of art, making sure that we can screen print it, place it in this case, one individual piece and one individual box, and then getting it on that truck and delivering it to whatever location that may be. That's really our goal right now. We have several ways that we can do this, but we just wanted to make sure I give you a little bit of a visual in case it's something where, where we can help. Now, with that being said, I wanted to make sure if you have any questions, we can review those with you. And I'm going to go ahead and pass it back on over to the lovely Kim. Thanks, Jennifer. OK, so we did have a couple questions for the ceramic mug. Um, we have a question of if the bottom is the only place that can be imprinted. You, so great question. I know sometimes I go through that so quickly. You can imprint the entire piece. So I feel like a lot of them, I'm going to grab one here just to show you um, the full visual. So you have the entire item to work with on the exterior. This is one that has a cork base because natural materials are selling so well right now, as you saw on the clay. But this one is going to give you a better visual and just kind of showing off how much imprint space that you can utilize on the piece itself. This is cork, so you wouldn't imprint the bottom on this one, but we have other pieces, bear with me. I've got so much stuff, I gotta make sure I show it. But you can see here that you do have a large amount of space on the bottom to use too. So if you wanted to print on the piece itself, you can use a full wrap, again, two sides, however you wanna showcase it, and then you have the bottom imprint for a secondary location or on the bottom by itself, whatever you prefer. 
perfect. Um, our next question is the stackable mugs that you mentioned, do you have a holiday set like holiday colors coming out or is it just the standard color palette that you have currently? We'll have the standard color palette that you saw. You'll have the two exterior colors and then you will have the, the there'll be five different interior colors. You can take those five different colors and partner them with the gray or take those five different internal colors and partner them with the white. If you are wanting to create more of a holiday look, we do have holiday designs where we can partner with the team and you can create your own kind of holiday visual on those if you'd like to do that. Perfect. Um, do you have an example of the marble look that you can I, showcase? I do. Oh, yes. I was like, wait, I should. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I hope this can be seen on camera fairly well. Um, with this one, I think it's kind of nice because each one has its own little marble feel. So you'll notice that it has a little bit of a difference in the texture. So this is just our C handle version of that. I hope this comes okay, uh, comes over okay on camera. Um, wanted you to just see how it looks decorated. And then I think I have my little sticker on the bottom, so I'll try and cover that up. But you can see here that we have a base imprint on this one too. So you can see it has more of a matte texture on, again, it, I don't know if you can see that. It has more of a matte texture on the outside and then the inside will give you more of a glossy feel. Okay. Um, for the Damon coffee mug, is that uh, dishwasher and microwavable safe or is everything pretty much in the line? Um, hand wash recommended, not recommended for the microwave, just trying to make sure that we classify those. Yeah, I always say it's best to hand wash everything. You want to take your logo, you want to preserve it for as long as possible. So by hand washing it, you're just extending the life of that ink. So that's really more where it comes into play. Um, we want to keep everything uh, uh, safe, just to keep up with compliance in our industry to make sure that you're distributing products that are safe for everyone. So with that being the case, we always say with the inks, we wanna make sure that you are hand washing them so that you have something that will stay on there as long as humanly possible. Perfect. Um, we did have some other questions. Do you sure. have any products that have the copper lining like Yeti is very popular with this Pelican um, for the stay cold for extended periods of time or stay hot for extended periods of time. Yeah, I love I love that question because this is something that comes up frequently. I'm going to hold up something like this one. I'm going to hold up something like this one. Pretty much, I mean, you're going to have exceptions to that. It's something that we can we can narrow down options for you, but there are a wide array of water bottles as well as a wide array of travel mugs that are going to give you the exact same insulation as a brand name piece that you probably love. Not, not excluding or including anybody. Uh, what I'm seeing is that it's the same exact insulation. Um, copper lining, Copper lined uh, double wall insulated drinkware, wanted to make sure I said that correctly, <laughs> is <laughs> far and away probably the most, most requested type of drinkware right now. And what that just means is that what you're purchasing retail, you're trying to find that same look and something in your promotional items. It There is no better type of insulation out there. It is the best type of insulation available. And it's nice because you can get something that's really well priced in our industry, put your logo on it, and you know that you're going to have that exact same type of insulation. But if you are trying to find one specifically in the water bottle family or travel mug family, then we can partner with Brew City and Goodland Supply and help you find the right piece. Perfect. Um, so we have one last question and it involves around eco products slash sustainability. Um, I know that you have the cork line and the clay line. Is there any other options that you have, say, in like a water bottle or something like that that have those sustainability and eco options? Yeah, that's the nice part about drinkware. I think that when you're when you're purchasing again, like a water bottle, a ceramic mug, whatever it may be, you have these amazing new materials, as you mentioned, like the cork and the clay that are extremely on trend. These are what people are. This is what people are asking us about right now. It's what you're seeing retail. But within all of that, instead of using a single use water bottle, you have something that's sustainable. You have something that's metal or pick and fill in the blank material glass in some instances like George and I were speaking about earlier. You have that piece that you can use over and over and over again. So you have something that's going to fall in that line of sustainability. Sounds good. All right, well, I greatly appreciate you showcasing all of this, Jennifer. Um, we did have a lot of sample requests and questions from the audience, so I think you did a great job. I really appreciate that.
Thank you. We greatly appreciate all of you guys for taking the time to meet with us today and being a part of our very first Good Land Supply new product review live webinar. We will be doing another webinar March 18th at 11 a.m. with the focus being on branded apparel. Some of the um, clothing brands that we will be featuring are Champion, Under Armour, and Puma, just to name a few. Look for the sign up for that on our social sites as well as through our e-blast. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to us. We greatly appreciate you taking the time to meet with us. Have a fantastic Thursday, everybody.